My name is Monica Burns. I'm an ed tech and curriculum consultant, founder of ClassTechTips.com, and a webinar host for Simple K-12. I want to talk to you today about how to practice math vocabulary online using a terrific tool from the Math Learning Center called Math Vocabulary Cards. Now, this is available for Chrome stores, a Windows store, Apple App stores, an app, or you can open up the app um, on the web, um, the web app, if you will, which we're going to take a look at today. So this is a set of interactive digital vocabulary cards for math students. When you click down here, it lets you decide which um, vocabulary cards you want to focus on. You can switch between K2 and 3-5. You can decide we're only going to work in one category, um, like measurement or three-dimensional shapes. It's completely up to you. What this does is it will hide um, one of these for you and you can check it and then you can hide the other one if you so choose. So it gives you a set of information, a visual, an actual definition, and then the hidden word. And so when we click, it'll reveal for us. If you take a look down here, you can say let's keep the word and the example but hide the definition. So if we switch here and we say what does it mean to add something? Students can describe that in their own words, oops, and then they can click here and see if the definition matches what they thought as well. One neat thing is that you can change these from Spanish to English. So great if you're working with students who English is not their first language and they um, would benefit from a Spanish definition or Spanish vocabulary um, as well. So let's go in here again and let's go back to our K2 and we're going to go to our all and uncheck all of them and go back out to fractions because this is what we just want to focus on today. If we hit start, it'll show me the image and I'll say what is a whole, right? And I can say a whole is and practice giving that definition and then click here to check the answer. So this is a terrific tool if you're doing a whole class review on the interactive whiteboard, if you want students to practice one-on-one, -on -one, if you're looking for suggestions to support students who might be struggling in your class and suggestions of what to share with them and their families to practice at home, this is a totally free, easy to use tool um, that I highly recommend, very interactive, and lets students take some ownership of their own experience as they practice different pieces as well. And maybe my favorite part is the visual here because that's going to really help solidify um, for students who may struggle with the comprehension of reading the actual definition. So if you are looking for how to practice math vocabulary online, I suggest checking out vocabulary cards by the Math Learning Center.